Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my let's play of Fallout 3. Now unfortunately, the game That's crashed cool. at the after the after the end of the last oh. So we've gone back a bit. Load and run 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 run. Oh, already dead. Heal! Is it just gas? I'm curious. Nope. Which means we have to plant that bomb all over again. But we know where everything is. And to be honest, I've probably been pussyfooting about a bit too much in this simulation. And should have been running more like a madman. Don't let one of them come. I was trying to shoot his backpack. And duck behind cover, reloaded. Come out, shoot, shooty. Uh, another guy, shoot, shooty. Reload. Oh! In the face. Ammo. Shame I'm not going to be able to take all this out with me afterwards. Not able to tell people. Okay, well, let's plan a bomb on this thing. Of course, plant the explosives. Now let's run. Uh, maybe up here, actually. I think we can get up here. It's like a bit of a back passage. Right, I've planted it. Will it explode on its own? Uh, quests. Notes. Quests. No idea. Hoping so. Plant explosives. Did you just call for the police? Oh, oh, oh. Um. Not quite sure. The thing just blew up, didn't it? Back here again. Reload. Might as well heal up what little health I lost. Come on. Run faster. Would much rather have wonder. Why is his backpack not going? Oh. Cover. Come back and fire. Somebody around here. Reload. Plant the thing. You have 20 seconds to reach a safe distance. Okay. How much is a safe distance? It does mean I might actually... Check I killed everything before I plant it on this one again. Flame for all guy. Purposely trying to blow up your backpack, it's just not working. Oh. Damn, can't take Chinese flame thrower. Okay. Plant the charge. Run away. That one's still firing. Don't let one of those come Ow. in the face and reload. Come on. Where's that coming from? Oh, you're not dead. Let's get all the health and stuff that we can do, and I think once we've blown up this one, it should be the end of a simulation. This is all good and done, isn't it? Last gun. Blow the that thing off the map. Now let's run away. Oh, it appears we do have a correct direction to go. Let's 
reload. Them extra five bullets might be the difference between life and death. I think this is the road that we would have taken if we'd have gone the other way. How was that not a safe distance? That's the front down there. These frick's sake. Oh, oh. 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 Try all this again. Reload. See, I'm not dying because I'm being over, you know, over gun ho and running in. Because I have to run away faster than in her face. Reload. Guy to the left. There's the last guy here. Plant this. Run away. How did that last one get me? It's nice that the Chinese and the Americans share ammo. Yeah, so think that uh, NATO and everything gets sorted between even America and most of Europe. But no enemies sharing the same ammunition cap. Screw it. Heal up. Hit the button. Plant the charges. Now we're going to run down. Uh, you might want to move. Crossfire. And we know you're in there. Let's come around here. So all of them dead, mate? We good? I think I'm gonna run back up the way we came. Oh, that's that way. Blow that thing off the map. So I'm gonna check the map. I'm gonna try this way. Hoping that getting around this corner will be enough. And they all come tumbling down. Yeah. Report to the general at headquarters. That's a long way to freaking go. Are you running the way we need to go? Or is that the end of it? Added. The general is damn fine work you did taking out those guns. Damn fine. Allow the gen general to continue. Thank you, sir. No need to thank me. I know a genuine, true-blooded soldier when I see one, and that's why I sent you. Unfortunately, while you were up there climbing mountains, we were down here getting our butts kicked. The Chinese decided to use our field HQ for target practice, and damn near blew us all to pieces. It's my best. I we lost some good men, including my strike team commander, Colonel Patterson. Uh, anything else I can do, sir? I didn't call you down here for a pep talk and cigars. You've earned yourself a field promotion, soldier. Whoop, whoop. As of this moment, you're taking over Patterson's strike team. Can we change the name? Before you thank me, you better wait and see what your mission entails. What are my orders, sir? There are three hardened targets that stand between us and the Chinese headquarters. That's where your strike team comes in. Follow me over to the situation map and I'll bring you up to speed. Very anxious to speak with you. I'd get over to the map and listen to the general's briefing if I were you. I'm trying. Come on. I'm over at the map. 
I can't get any more over at the map. I'm pushing E. Um, hollow tape. I'm okay. Notes. Molly, I'm, I'm okay. Everything's fine. I was found, but not by the Chinese. It was the captain who found me. Cap says everything will be okay. Lieutenant Thomas it's Morgan, intelligence hours, and logistics and at I'm, your service. I, I'd, I'd I get over to, to the map you know, and listen I'm to the general's. Right. I'm in the refinery now, resting. Cap brought me here. We snuck around the Chinese and made it in. It's I can't, don't care about any of that. I got. I got shot, Mo. Okay, pay attention, sure. soldier. I'm only gonna go through this once. We set up our new field HQ down here. Didn't mean the area to have these both going over at once. The Sorry. The first of the three targets we need to handle right. is their Chimera that Depot over here. Bunch of meds, Be careful so on your approach. You're gonna anymore. have to get through the enemy camp on Patch the way. Me up pretty good, Once you breach the perimeter of the Still depot, bleeding. you need to take out both that of the main stop. fuel tanks. I can hear your second the other target is all the way over here. Fighting. The Chinese have so set up a much. listening There's any point for me to be looking at this table, it's not pointing at anything. There are some abandoned mines along the route, so keep your eyes and ears open. It's a great place for an ambush. You need to clear the place of personnel, so we can get our intelligence boys in there to start decoding. Once the first two targets are down, the last obstacle standing in the way is their damn pulse field. You need to cross it, then cause it to overload, so we can mop up the place with the T-51Bs. Let me warn you now, unless you have some sort of a death wish, I wouldn't even go near the field until the first two targets are down. Lieutenant Morgan will be your eyes and ears for Operation Anchorage, so get everything else you need from him. Uncle Sam's invested a lot of money turning you into a killing machine. Time to pay him back. Dismissed! Now, let's talk to you. So, you're in charge of Patterson's Suicide Squad, huh? You're not gonna stand up and talk to me properly? Okay, yeah. Uh, very funny, Lieutenant. Hey, all I got to keep me warm out here in this freeze box is my sense of humor. Anyway, I'm here to give you a hand with intelligence and logistics. Whatever you need, I'm your guy. Uh, the strike team, I've never led troops before like that. Don't worry about it. Sergeant Montgomery will be your squad commander, and he knows all the ins and outs of the team. If you need anything, like reinforcements or status reports, just speak to him. So, what else can I do for you before you hit the field? Uh, I need to discuss my team, I guess. Okay, that's what I'm here for. How do I put a strike team together? Uncle Sam's made it really easy for you. All you have to do is use Patterson's terminal here in the command tent. Use the recruitment markers I gave you and choose your team members any way you see fit. Then head outside to the barracks and your units will be ready to go. That's rather nice. Uh, can't I just take... A whole bunch of guys with me? No way. The bigger your strike team, the bigger your footprint on all the Chinese sensing devices. You need to think small. The recruitment markers I gave you will recommend what size you keep your team in order to maintain the smallest footprint possible. So to put it simply, you pick a big clunky robot and you won't have much room left in the team for many other units. You decide. Hmm. Uh, what if I lose a strike team member? You can always speak to your strike team squad leader and requisition a new unit if you've lost one. Nice. Uh, let me change the subject. Okay, whatever you need. And we'll end the episode there. As always, thank you for watching, and goodbye.